Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we've got some exciting news for Linux fans. Linux Mint 22.1, codenamed Zia, is here in its beta version. And trust me, there's a lot to unpack, so stick around as we dive into the highlights of this release. First off, let's talk about Cinnamon 6.4, the desktop environment that headlines this release. It comes with some fantastic new features. We're talking about a built-in nightlight mode. Finally, no more eye strain during those late-night coding sessions. Plus, there's a fresh default theme, native dialogues, and, this one's huge, much better Wayland compatibility. For those of you on modern hardware, this is a big deal. But wait, there's more. Notifications have been enhanced, sound over amplification settings are simpler, and the Nemo file manager has received some love with new improvements. This update really seems focused on polish and usability. Now, for all you package management pros out there, you're going to appreciate the faster and modernized software manager. The APT dependencies have also been updated to improve package management overall. Oh, and for anyone who works with bulk file renaming, the updated bulky utility now supports removing accents from file names. Nice touch, right? Thumbnail support for .aura files. Better power management. The list just keeps going. Under the hood, Linux Mint 22.1 is still based on Ubuntu 24.04 LTS, also known as Noble Numbat, and runs on the Linux 6.8 kernel. As a long-term support release, you'll get security updates all the way through 2029. So, yeah, this version is built for the long haul. If you're as excited as I am, you can grab the beta version of Linux Mint 22.1 gel right now from the official mirrors. Just remember, this is a beta release. It's meant for testing, not production work. An official announcement from the Linux Mint team is expected by the end of the week, so keep an eye on their blog for more details. All right, folks, that's your early glimpse into Linux Mint 22.1 Zia. What feature are you most excited about? Is it the nightlight, the faster package management, or something else? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And of course, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell icon for more updates on Linux and open source tech. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video.